Matt Alvarez for Outspot Nashville, and we are here at BMI in Nashville, Tennessee. And I can tell you, we interviewed someone that is pretty cool, a Rascal Flats band member, Jay DeMarcus. He's the founder of Red Street Records, and he had a great announcement today. Take a listen. It's a watershed moment for us in our young life because I feel like we are signing two of what will eventually be our brightest stars in Kate Thompson and Reagan Strange. You know, I'll tell you, last year when I've run into several people in the music industry and people that are friends of mine, family of mine, ask me one thing consistently, why in God's name are you opening up a record label? It's a fair question. It's a lot of work and a lot of money and a lot of time. And I believe these two young people right here are the very reason we did open a record label because I believe in their message and I believe what they carry with them the world needs to hear. Uh, come on up here. Okay. Seriously. Okay, Reagan. Uh, this is this is Reagan right here. Yeah, I'll just let them say this on the introduce themselves and tell you how much they love me. <laughs> Reagan and first off I just want to say I'm so honored and humbled to be a part of the Red Street family and I can't first of all you know first off I just want to give all the glory to God for you know just giving me this opportunity and for Jay for welcoming me onto the label and just for the proper team and the Red Street team that's going to help me along the way and to all my friends and family that came out and they drove three or four hours to come see me I'm just so excited to make some music to inspire people because that's, that's, the, that's the whole goal. And um, you know, I'm excited. I'm really excited to make some awesome music and I can't wait to share it with everyone. Hey everybody, my name is Kate Thompson and uh, I'm so excited to be with all of you today. It's kind of like a, a dream come true, honestly. <laughs> like as a middle schooler, I remember just uh, dreaming of a day to have a record label partnership exactly like this one. And it's been a lot of ups and downs through the past years, but uh, uh, I remember when I first met Jay and Don and the whole team, something just clicked like right away. I felt like our vision just was aligned and uh, they believed in the songs. And so a special thank you to Matt Armstrong, uh, to Jay, to Don, and the uh, people who believed in me over the years. And uh, I'm excited for next year. Let's go. First of all, uh, congratulations on this, man. I mean, tell us your thoughts right now. You see all the people. You see the next step that you're going to. Yeah, it's a dream come true, honestly, for me. Very exciting. Uh, it's cool to see how all the work that's been done in the past can uh, lead up to something like this. And I'm just thankful for Jay and the team who's believed in this and excited for this music to come. So Tell us where you get your inspiration. I mean, where, where you getting the, the, the new material, the new songs, all that. Honestly, my inspiration is just through life stories and what God has taught me through life and uh, how inside each song that I write, there's a testimony of God's goodness in every single song. So Pretty cool to use your talents mixed in as well, right? When you're using your talents, but you're also delivering a great message. Yeah, I really hope to share an inspirational message to a lot of teenagers because I feel like they don't really have somebody to look to for that kind of stuff. So I'm really excited to be able to put my own twist on the world of music. I, I mean, I was so excited when I got the first phone call, just even thinking about it. So I just, I'm so honored and humbled to be a part of this team and I can't wait. Same thing, same thought, right? You were pretty pretty surprised or were you kind of like that this was about, this was supposed to happen? I mean, I was surprised, but at the same time, just very thankful for someone like him to believe in my music and uh, it was just felt like the right thing for me. So very excited. That's awesome. And OHIO, first of all. Absolutely. Go Bucks. Yeah. Important stuff out of the way. I'm a Buckeye fan too. Your, your thoughts about these uh, lovely people? You know, it's just exciting for me to see young people people coming up in a new generation and be inspired by them and to really see a reflection of myself in them because I was so consumed by music growing up and it's all that I set my sights on doing and it's, I, was, I sort of had a one track mind. I wanted to make music at all costs and so to see people as passionate about their art as I was when I was younger, it makes me thrilled to know that I can give them a little bit of a platform to go out and take their message to the world. Sounds like a built-in mentorship. I mean, 